Good afternoon, everyone. This is Christy with Van Auto Company. It's Thursday, December 13th. I'm going to go over the markets with you. Uh, you did get a private sale here this morning released to China for soybeans at 1.1 million metric tons, and the market was very disappointed with that. Uh, rumors yesterday were anywhere from 500,000 to 2.4 million metric tons. Now, more can come out of this. This isn't like it's it, uh, but the market was wanting something larger as we have to close the gap of 13 million metric tons that we are behind pace on export sales in general. We're okay um, we really needed to get this demand coming up to really um, solidify this price that we're at we've built a lot of optimism and premium into this bean market on the hopes of China buying a large amount of beans and uh, we need that to follow through or you're gonna see some negativity so beans down 13 on the day it weighed on corn down a penny on the day but you did have support into the wheat market anywhere from six cents to nine and a half cents higher um, no real reason why wheat was up when you had the rest of the market separate except for maybe you could be seeing managed money um, going after the wheat market or spreading between uh, beans and corn and wheat but that positivity was really broad based across the wheat complex meat markets saw some mixed trade live cattle slightly negative feeders up just almost a buck higher and then lean hogs um, slightly negative as well outside markets were movers all day long with the Dow market trading both sides but closer to steady by the end of the the day um, and you saw the crude market really start to take off at the end of the day as well moving forward what we're going to be watching is export sales any private sales announcements we haven't heard any additional rumors of china buying since uh, yesterday and then with this 1.1 um, there's some talks maybe of possibly up to 5 million metric tons um, so i should say there's that rumor i guess but we're waiting to see and like i said they need to solidify 13 million metric ton to really close that gap that we're running behind pace on export sales i do have to close with the disclaimer trading futures and options involves risk loss and is not suitable for all producers have a great day